Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So, yeah, in today's video, I'm doing this creepy tooth fairy look. So, I've had a couple ideas when I started this. Uh, my first idea was just something completely monstrous and scary. Uh, and then my second idea was just to kind of have this beautiful tooth fairy transitioning into this evil monstrous tooth fairy who is just fed up with fetching all of these kids teeth that she starts consuming them and they start growing out of her face <laughs> that's kind of morbid but you know it is halloween and that's what it's all about so yeah this was really fun to do and uh if you want to see how i did this then just keep watching all right, so using my Mehron Paradise Pink Palette, I'm going in with this like gray bluish shade uh, and I am putting this all over. Now you will have to do several coats because as you can see, it's really thin, but I also think I added a little bit too much water. So uh, just make sure you build this color up and this is gonna be your base. Now taking a q-tip I'm gonna put some prosade on my forehead and I'm gonna start adding my creepy teeth uh, you can also use spirit gum that's really good too uh, but yeah this is actually my favorite part now I got these teeth off of Amazon uh, they are really creepy looking because they look so real uh, but they're not <laughs> so uh, yeah just add them as you see fit Now I wasn't really sure which way I wanted to go with this if I wanted to just do like this black smoky eye and I don't know from her transitioning to being a you know a pretty fairy to a evil fairy I wanted to do a little bit more of a beauty makeup but I did not want to make it perfect by any means uh, so I went in with the blue blood palette from Jeffree Star and I just started playing with colors I kind of and I started with the shade blue blood and obviously I put this all over the lid uh, and then I went in with the shade deceased and for my actual lid shade I ended up using ocean ice I also took undertaker and I put this all along my lower lash line uh, just to kind of make her look tired
Now, of course, we are going to start going in with some scab blood. So I put this all around the teeth. I mark, mark the teeth up with it. And of course, I make it look like it is dripping. Originally, I did a blue lipstick. Uh, I decided to change it to red. I kind of wish I would have stuck with the blue, but whichever is your preference, go with it. guys so that's it for this creepy tooth fairy look i hope you enjoyed the video if you did please give it a big old thumbs up for me and i will see you guys on the next one bye